Well, first of all, uh, I was honored to, and honored to be referred to by many of my troops, in the, especially the 3rd of the 7th Special Forces, and my people in the Southern Fruit Copper Corporation after I retired that I put together in the security field. Honored to be considered a mentor and watch these guys move up to high ranks in the military and, and, and in the civilian life in Peru. So that, but one of the things that stuck out to me was that in a special forces unit, especially, there's a lot of reverse mentorship required because if you have a, an example, a new officer just out of training comes in and takes over an A-team, it's full of experienced people, and they have to mentor him and bring him along in order for him to be able to complete the mission. And, it, and, and it's, it, it's nice to know that when I was an NCO and when I did that, when I, tried, when I mentored him, I also might make suggestions to him how best to complete a mission, but I tried to make it look like it was his idea. But that's basically the way I, I felt about it.